sometimes there is a requirement to redirect the url which is pointing to a cloud fund distribution for example just imagine that you have configured a domain in a public hosted zone in route 53 which is aws managed service for dns and that route 53 entry which is maybe an alias is pointing to a domain uh, a cloud fund distribution so for example you have some dummy domain like www.dummy.com and it, it is pointing to a cloud front now you want to redirect this www.dummy.com to let's say www.dummy1.com if it's an apex domain you cannot redirect it in route 53 so you have to do some workaround the workaround is in this case is to do the redirection at the cloud front level so when someone accesses www.dummy.com route 53 sends it to that cloud front distribution and then within that cloud front distribution you can redirect it to www.dummy1.com in order to do that what you can do you can have a function defined on the cloud front level and how you can do it let me show you quickly okay so on your screen you can see that i have this dummy cloud front distribution where I don't have anything defined, but it's simply pointing to an S3 bucket, which is okay. Now, going back to my CloudFront screen, now in this screen, you can see that on the left hand side, you have a section called as functions. You can define a function, so click on function, create function here, then give it a name. I would just call it dump function, and then an optional description, click on create function. So this is creating a dummy function now when you see this dummy function you will see that there's a code editor here now in remove this line here and then let me give you a sample code for redirection now this is a simple node.js code a handler function which is returning a status code of 302 and here you can replace your destination url i'm just calling it dummy dummy1.com after you're done click on save changes and then save click on test case and then you can just click on test function and if you go down it should give you green or 302 which is correct that there are no errors here this is what we wanted and then you can publish this function. I'm publishing it and it got published, which is fine. Now, at the bottom, when you scroll down, you'll see association. Click on add association and then you can uh, select your distribution here. Let me select it. As you can see, I have selected my distribution and I have sent via request at the default and then the cache behavior should be default scaring. Once that's done, click on add association and then association will be added here. So now what will happen is as soon as the request from route 53 will come to your distribution from distribution, the uh, because it is associated with that function, it the, that function will get triggered and it will redirect that URL to your destination URL. I hope this was useful. If you have any feedback, please put it in the comment section. Thank you.